our short visit to dead Moscow, the phantom of the past, is over. Pavel and I helped each other out again, and are returning down to the metro as real partners now. You can't survive the wastelands any other way. But now ahead of us lies a populated station, the theater. It's very close to Polis. If Pavel manages to lead me through the red line guard posts, I'll be home in less than an hour. Let's just hope it's that easy. Let's go. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? Yeah. Can I get one of those? Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the wrecked plane. Yeah. Probably two or three. Oh, you want a nightmare? Oh, it's waiting for you up there. <laughs> no sense going with just three men. No, take 30 maybe. I guess I'll just follow Pavel. He seems to know his way around. So, if it's culture you want, the Bolshoi is up there above us. All the actors who survived are here. Right, okay. all over the metro to see the shows they put on. For each campaign. Oh dear. The devil's in the details and this game's got a lot. We've been in the rake all our lives, and now we're freaks? Ugh. This happens all the time. You see, I just want to sit in on this conversation and just watch it for like half an hour, you know? Raising the standards. Last time it was our neighbors. This time, it's us. Would be long before Fiora has the station to himself. But what do we do now? Live. And be glad <sighs> I, I can't sit here forever. Measured every day. So, that's our plan. The station next to this one is Revolution Square. Ah, okay. Red. And revolution is fitting distance to Poles. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through, and you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Sounds good to me. The one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in then. All right. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here. Huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Sounds good. Have a good rest. All right. Blah, get out of the way. Ooh, it's a note. I've got to read. Let's have a look then. Note one of two, it looks like. Pavel needs some time to set everything up. The citizens of other stations need a permit to enter the red line. The state in permanent preparation for war readily sees a spy in any outsider. So I have some time to look around the theatre. This station is a real legend of the metro. Not unlike Polis. The difference being that while Polis gathered most of the surviving scientists, the theatre is considered to be the cultural capital of the metro. Cool. Might be in for something pretty good here. It's, start it's starting to look like a uh, the first station from the first game. Pigs too. And drunks. Whoa. <laughs> is he alright? Probably not. Is that one dead? Nope. He might be. I didn't see anything though. Let's just leave Bullets him. To the last surviving theatrical critic. Bullets for mercy on your souls. Can I give him anything? Oh, go on then. Go, young men. I see you like my witty side. There is a place for everyone in this underground. Murderers, whores, tyrants, money changers, even peasants for Christ's sake. All are welcome here. Even lousy actors. I live in a theater where we breathe the miasma of the decaying Bolshoi. The station is overpopulated with the ghosts of the opera. But is there a place here for the best critic of our once great country? Hell no. I tell the truth. And I am repaid with insults and poverty? I say you are a disgrace to the name of Bolshoi. And they reply, now Bolshoi is us and us alone. They're immune to criticism. They choose money over art. And these poor souls traveling from all over Metro to see the glorious Bolshoi? They are played for fools. Is that right? They say that art only interests the well fed. But, my young friend, I will argue that even the hungry need art. For thinking on exalted matters dulls the pain of an empty stomach. But, sadly, True art is 20 years gone. What remains is profane trash. And so my own hunger persists. Will you honor what we've lost by perhaps donating a bullet? 
you know what? I've already given you one, and that's probably enough. I feel I might get like a ten minute long speech if I give you another one. See ya. I myself. Well, well, well. Where do I start? Let's go get a drink. I can't get anything? No. Can't I smoke or something? Get a hash pipe around here or something? What have you got then? Oh! These instruments! I can play them, right? Yeah! Oh god, what to focus on? What to focus on? Hey, it's a juggler! Shadow puppets as well. What's going on? Meteor didn't make it. How? They were heading back. Wow. A demon That's appeared. A demon. We so all hit the ground and shot at the, at the demon until it fled. No one suffered the scratch, but Vidya didn't get up. His mask, it had cracked open on the brick. And you, you left him there to die. No, Katya, he tried to save him. But it was too late. No! Vidya! We buried him there. A wood place. We put white stones on the grave. God damn. <laughs> Shit. Alright, let's uh... Let's see you juggling then. Entertaining the kids. Sort of. Shadow puppets? What is that? Surge, did your dad tell you about beasts like that? No, and he was everywhere. Even the library. There, there is too much going on. Let, let's let's just keep going. Oh, oh, I thought they were notes. Oh no, Metro 2035, Metro 2033, and 2034 over here. Yep, nothing like a bit of plug-in. Yep. Okay, let's keep going. Market. Ah, here we go. I might want to buy some ammo here, really. So, can I buy any of this? Apparently not. Um, this? Ah, here we go. Yeah, there we go. So, is it ammo? Secondary weapons as well? Incendiary grenades? Ah, grenades, throwing knives. I, I'm going to leave that for now, but ammo I'm interested in. Let's see. Yeah, look, I've got no assault rifle ammo at all. I used it coming into this station. So, what is it? Ten for ten military grade bullets for thirty assault rifle rounds. That's good. I'm gonna get like hundred and twenty. Um, none of my weapons use the steel balls right now. Buckshot. That's near max. Buy a couple more pistol rounds, maybe about sixty, sixty or so. That'll do. Okay, alright. Uh, oh, more guns, more guns. Out the way. Let's have a look, let's have a look. I don't think I'll bother with either of these two, but there might be a couple more hiding behind them. Do I want to trade this in for something, maybe? Or that? Or that? Let's have a look. What would it be for? Uh, a duplet? A duplet? 12 gauge shotgun? A T car? Ah, that's the uh, that's the thing that fires the steel balls. It's good. Standard revolver. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna keep my uh, my weapons as they are for now. They seem to be doing the job quite well so far. So uh, you know, don't fix what ain't broke. What do you sell me? Uh, nothing I want. And you? No. Ah. Ah. What are we here? Do I get anything for doing that? Nope. 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 Alright, where are we now? Ooh, really? Let's go this way. Oh, there's another note. This must be the second note. Let's have a look then. Okay. No wonder. The world famous Bolshoi Theater is right above that station. There are rumors that there are underground passages from its basement into the metro, and that's the reason why so many of its actors and other staff were able to save themselves on Judgment Day. They founded a new Bolshoi down here at the station. It is the theater rumors of which reach even the farthest corners of the metro. And since the habitable world ends where the metro lines end, you could say that the new Bolshoi is also known around the world. Some say it actually preserves the tradition of its great predecessor. They say that the earth continues to spin while the boy Bolshoi still puts on the shows. How I wished I got to see one of those. Perhaps I finally got my chance? Maybe. Maybe I have. It's a long queue though. 
Unless I can just sort of subtly slip in. No, I can't. I'm very intrigued, I have to say. Oh, hello. Well, Artyom, I made all the arrangements. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the theater. Does that mean I don't have to stand in line? Because there's a lot. Oh, we're going in. Hey, you. Stop. Show me your tickets. Oh, sure. Come in. Not bad. Well, I guess Pavel's quite well known around here. Watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. All right. Well, I think I'm going to watch the show. Wow, it's pretty packed. <laughs> it's the can can. I see. Right. Okay. <laughs> Is there a spare seat somewhere? I guess I could just stand here. I sit. Oh, I can sit down. That's great. Just think about this for a moment. There was probably a group of people who sat down and worked for about a week on these um, jiggle physics. Probably just for this part as well. I guess that shows a certain level of dedication, I suppose. Is there anything else? Has never witnessed anything like this before. I feel sorry for the other performers now. Their attempts at impressing the audience might fall short after such a spectacle. But <laughs> I trust they will handle the race far of our expectations. And thus, our incredible show continues. This man spits in the eye of danger, challenges nature, defies the god of his new world, and proves once again that humanity is a master of all. A warm welcome for Leonid Burli, our animal trainer extraordinaire, with his uh, terror of our city. Terror of our city, eh? Go on then. What we got? Oh, that doesn't sound good. What the? Oh no, it's... Oh, it's performing. That's great. You can train them? Uh... <laughs> this doesn't feel very safe. Oh dear. No, uh, oh boy. Am I gonna have to get my gun out? I. I oh dear. <laughs> Alright, okay. Uh, I should probably continue on. But, wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I, I gotta see what this is. Fearsome beasts, black as midnight, invincible, able to induce madness in anyone who saw them. But even those were no match for human ingenuity. The guys at the exhibition had noticed they were brewing the wrong mushrooms. <laughs> and they went back to the traditional recipe. The new mutants were gone like morning dew. <laughs> Let us cheer for the heroes at exhibition. And tonight's show goes it's great. On. It is time to bring a lyrical mood to our show. We give you the genius of chamber music, the famous accordion player, Kola Pajarni, with his masterpiece, My Heart Reaches for the Sky. But hits the ceiling and falls down the bottom. <laughs> that is the best title I've ever heard. That is great. Oh, and he's drunk as well. This cannot go wrong. All right, all right. I really should get going. I think. I was just curious to see what was up next. Pavel, should we go? Oh yes. Well, I wouldn't go that far. Oh my, where are we going? Backstage. Hello, hello. Oh, 
Everyone seems to know him. So we're going through there now, okay. So where's this lead? And this is where people sleep, I imagine. Oh, oh, he's leaving me. He always bloody leaves me. Oh, hello. Dinner for two, is it? Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but uh, let's drink to the fact we are still alive, huh? Tell me, okay? Right. No, we're gonna sit down, we're gonna have a drink. Okay. I like this. It's a nice diversion from the usual gameplay. Opa, that's great. So, let's drink it to him. Now they're full already. Oh yeah, that's pretty strong. I'm feeling it already. Yeah, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. But it's awful there. No food, <laughs> Look at David Blaine back there. You can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom. Oh, didn't we finish it? Wow. So, <clears throat> yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order, and everything is shared: food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true, but no beggars either. Another drink! And now? Metro communism in a nutshell. Come on, no, 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 no. <laughs> was, was he just pouring that over his shoulder? Uh, yes. Yes. Look, look at the far stations. They're freaking eat each other. Sell their kids at slaves. And it's like the Stone Age. Death to his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order. I think that guy might want to stand on that table. Our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Oh boy. This one's gonna finish me off, isn't it? Oh. Yeah, it definitely is. Am I taking sips or something? So, my friend. Oh. That's how it goes. Don't be mad. Wait, no. What? No. You wouldn't do that, Pavel. Musketeer. Are from the wrong side of the barricade. Okay. I thought he was going to give me a pass or something. Oh, no, you wouldn't. Son of a bitch. Oh, that something in the drink. Oh. God damn it. Welcome back, comrade major. It is private. 